Okay, today is Tuesday, June 23rd. Just coming back from downtown, and I saw this article in the San Francisco Examiner. City takes a hit in tech scandal. Superior court size with cops facing termination over bigoted text messages by removing police commission from the statute of limitation decision. Page 8. Well, what happened was that some officers had done some no-nos, and uh, apparently... You know, the uh, city, when it, you know, got, found out about these things, apparently didn't act on it timely. You know, all in risk management effect. This is how the city operates, you know. When these attorneys, you know, I'm sorry, when these officers committed the no-no, they informed everyone. As a matter of fact, I think it says somewhere in this article that uh, in, it was in 2012 that they had been informed about the text. Now, you have to realize that this is the way the city manages everything. What is, the similarity between this, where they're, they're not handling it correctly, and, for example, my inability to give my complaint at the Sheriff's Internal Affairs or the OCC, you know, proves that the city is set up to scam people and to risk manage them away, but to certainly not do what is correct and legally required. This is just another example of risk management by the city, you know, to protect its own, when it knows what the law is and doesn't perform timely. In my case, it won't even take my examples, contrary to ADA, my disability and everything else, thereby preventing, you know, the statute of limitations, I'm not, not, not preventing, but allowing the statute of limitations to run out. It is a rigged methodology portrayed not only by the San Francisco Police Department with the Office of Citizens' Complaints, but also, in addition, uh, the San Francisco Sheriff's Department. Uh, not, there is no accountability. The, the, this article proves it. Oh, and also, if, you know, I wanted to inform you that I, I think it was last week or the week before, there was an article, you know, in the paper regarding OCC's dismal failure and how nobody seems, you know, to take them very seriously. That's the Office of Citizens' Complaints, you know, how the, uh, the citizens aren't pleased and the officers aren't pleased. I believe that was part of the headline in the article. Uh, just wanted to inform you, let the games continue, continue to watch the inhumanity, continue to realize that it's rigged, and after what you've seen today, you know, from all the lack of help that I've received, I will continue to videotape. Thank you.